I know I'm pretty sure you know that I'm a massive Sims 2 fan and when the expansion pack came out, Sims 2 Nightlife, I lost it. I loved it, I, I don't know why it had such a big hold on me as a kid. But one thing I never really did was play as a vampire. Strange thing to say when you're playing The Sims, but I kind of only went for realistic playthroughs. I used to make the same family all the time, I don't know why. Today, I'm changing that. So it's time for me to try something new. We're going to be playing as a vampire today. I don't even know how to do it. We're going to try it anyway, and we're just going to play with it for a while. So I won't waste any time, because for whatever reason, the camera is currently flickering the lights around me. You might be able to see that just all around me. So we'll jump into it. One thing that I did completely forget is that you can actually live downtown. I don't know why I didn't know you could do that. I mean, I did when I was a kid, but I completely forgot. So we're going to do that. We're going to live as close to the vampires as we can. Money's going to be no object for us, so we're going to move into this big house here. But let's make a sim. The last name is Sucker, it will make sense, because it's Bloodsucker. So I was going to go with this guy, but what is going on with that nose? So we're going to turn this guy into a dashing vampire. So I went against what I said, and instead of a dashing vampire, I've made him a bit more horrifying than I intended to. But he's got the romance aspiration, and he's into makeup wearing vampires, and he hates beards. We'll start with furnishings, and a nice car, we've got a garage. And a lot of money. We'll go with the black car because dark and mysterious. That bed can go. We need a coffin. And with all Sims games, they didn't quite finish this house. They didn't paint this. And it's going to bug me if I don't, so I'm doing that too. So we don't need to furnish it much. I don't think we're going to be home that much, to be honest. We're going to head out to downtown. I know we could literally walk there. But it's raining. <laughs> so we're not. We're taking the car. Crypto nightclub makes sense. Let's go there. Look at that. Actual cars. Sims 4 could never. So the first thing that we need to do is find another vampire. From what I can remember, we need to get the vampire to be friends enough that we can get them to bite us. Are there any vampires here? Do I have to wait till night? <laughs> I'm going to cheat again and I'm going to make it the night. There we are. It's 8pm. Maybe I should go somewhere else. Oh, never mind. Be my friend and then bite me. Okay, we're already friends. How do I get you to bite me? Ask. Please bite me. <laughs> okay, I had to Google it, and apparently they'll bite you of their own accord. So I'm just gonna wait until they do it. She's sitting down for dinner. <laughs> I'm dinner. What are you doing? I've literally been watching this woman eat for like two, three minutes. What has my life come to? I'll gossip with her. I heard a rumor that I really want you to bite me. Could you please? Oh, Mortimer. That's so embarrassing. <laughs> now is the time. Like you're into me, clearly, so bite me. She turned into a bat. <laughs> Please come back. I'm starting to understand why I never played as a vampire in The Sims 2, because it's so hard to do. I think I'm just going to have to invite her around to my house. Otherwise, I'm never going to be able to get her to actually do this. What turns you off? She hates people who are fit. So I'll get fat. Oh, she's burning. She's in the sun. <laughs> she's gone. And I'm gone too. I'm going home. We're back. I'm not sure if I can invite around straight away. Because it's daylight. But I'm going to try it anyway. Ah, it's too sunny. I'm burning up. Sorry, I can't hang out right now. Okay, we'll try again in the night. And Tessa says, I don't really have anything better to do. I'll be over soon. Oh, she's calling to cancel. I know it. Hey, I found some new places to hang out downtown. Do you want to meet me there? We just made plans. Yeah, um, I'm making a bait to Alaska right now. Couldn't possibly turn myself away. I thought you were going out. Stop lying to me. My psychic advisor has forbidden me from leaving the house today. I'm afraid I must comply. Do we not like each other anymore? There she is. This better work, because I've been recording for half an hour and I've got absolutely nowhere. Oh, I might have to cheat. <laughs> okay, so she's kissing me. And she's gone. <laughs> I'm just going to wait until the lifetime relationship bar reaches 50, rather than just the daily one. So he's just skipping. I literally don't know what else to do, so we're just studying cooking. <laughs> I'll never cook, but I'm doing it. I'm invited around again. It has to work this time. Okay, I'm asking her to move in. I couldn't wait anymore. Bite neck. <laughs> yeah, catch some, catch some fireflies, and then bite his neck. Finally. <laughs> that took 35 minutes. I've cheated and she's not part of the household anymore, so I don't even know if that means she's going to move out or not. But we're finally a vampire. We can do what we want. First things first. 
I'm going to stalk here. This is very slow. What if I fly here? Yeah. So we're going to head out and we're going to bite our first person now. We're finally doing it. <laughs> We've come to another silent lot. Well, let's change that. Let's sing. This is not what I was planning to do as my first day as a vampire, but <laughs> here we are. Has the lot filled up while we've been doing this? Malcolm Landgrab. Come here. I'm done singing. So we're going to check him out. We're not that bothered. But we're gossiping about Mortimer because he pissed himself in that club that we saw him in earlier. <laughs> okay, we're friends. Can I bite you right now? I don't know how to. I don't think I can yet. Okay, where are you going? Oh, it's the morning. I shouldn't be out either. What happens if I stand in the sun? I'll fly there. Okay, yeah. I Exactly what I expected. <laughs> that's not me. That's the witch. <laughs> yeah, your needs drop very fast. So let's go home. I don't want to die yet. Oh, she still lives with me. I might need to um actually get her to move out. I bought a computer so that she can move out, but even the desk is quite vampiric. And if vampiric isn't a word, it should be. Okay, away you go. Now you're moving out alone. So I'm going to try inviting Malco out on a date. I don't think we have any chemistry, but I'm going to try it and we're going to see if we can move him over and then bite him. <laughs> Here we are. Oh, we are constantly talking about Mortimer wetting himself. Slow dance. He wants to play. I'm going to tickle you. This is a very platonic date. <laughs> I can flirt with him a little bit. Let's try it. The music kicks in at just the right time. Okay, he wants to dance with us, so we've done that one. Hold on. I've just remembered there's hot tubs. Um, third wheel, much brandy? Why am I completely naked? <laughs> okay, now I've just got him practically nude, so I guess that was the tactic all along. Thanks, that was really fun. Let's do it again soon. You're really some kind of date. That's okay. We've worked him over a little bit. Next time we'll invite him out and we will actually bite him. So they have new idle interactions. Well, I said new. This is a very old game. But <laughs> I didn't know that they did that. So they hiss and make random blur sounds. <laughs> blur. So, since it's the day, we might as well get into our coffin. Um, you need to go down quite quickly in the day, even if you're inside, which I didn't know about. <laughs> I didn't even know that sound played as well. Okay, so, you also get the option to arise, which I assume is just wake up, but vampire style. So, I'm going to watch that too. <laughs> well, let's ask Malcolm round on a date round here. I did a double bed for obvious reasons. <laughs> yeah, let's just play a quick game of SSX3 before he gets here. There he is. He wants to slow dance and he wants to talk. We can talk. This date is going great. Please stop skipping. Oh, window. I'm going to ask that he stays the night. And let's leap into his arms. <laughs> he wants to slow dance. Propose. I'm not going to ask you to move in. So we'll woohoo and then we can bite his neck. Okay, he just fell in love with us and so now he wants to... Woohoo in the car. Have his very first woohoo. And woohoo. <laughs> I can't tell what he wants. I want that cutscene, so let's get up here. <laughs> the four poster bed and the wall are censoring this for me. I don't even have to worry about it. <laughs> Like a little bit like a smurf. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Can I ask him to join me in the car? Yes, I can. No, don't we who yet? Turn the stereo on. Mm. Never mind. <laughs> we'll do it in silence. Okay, stereo's on. Now we woohoo. Just feels right. This is gonna be a very quick woohoo, judging by the tempo of this music. <laughs> he had a great date. Good for him. Now I'm going to bite you. 
In my pajamas. I'm a very lazy vampire. Oh, he's very thankful for that. I'll propose engagement. No, um, he's going home. I asked you to stay the night. Oh, hi Malcolm. You're really risking your life to drop these flowers off. Just just to say. I can see the smoke coming off you as we speak. Why is everyone going to my back door to drop all this stuff off? Who's that from? Ah, the sun I must flee. <laughs> Dear Blood, Romance bloomed between us, as this single flower shows, and as I think of you, my sweet, my longing for you grows. I ruined the tempo of that one, Malcolm. I'm very sorry. Oh. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm recording this a little bit later, because we died, and I want to see that. <laughs> if someone's going to die, I want to watch it. So we're going to wait until the day, and we're going to put him out in the sun, and see what happens. Okay, it's the next day. We're going to stand him out here and we're going to see if this works. Is this guy just going to stand in the way the whole time? <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> it finally happened. That was fun. There's still not as much to do as I thought there would be, but maybe that's because I went into this blind and I didn't really know what I was doing, so I probably missed loads of things to do. So let me know in the comments if there is other things that you used to do when you played as a vampire. But if you enjoyed it, please feel free to drop it a like or a comment. It does really help. If you don't subscribe already, please do that too. That is one of the biggest helps you can do for the channel. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.